What's going on, folks? And happy Wednesday to you guys. Hope you guys had a great day and your night is going to be fantastic as well. So we are going to play a game that we actually did the demo version for a couple months ago. Uh, it might have been like three or four months ago. I don't remember exactly when it was, but it had good feedback from you guys and it has good feedback in general. This game is going to be very similar to Detroit Become Human. If you guys have never seen that series, I recommend going and watching that dude. That game gets pretty intense as it gets later on in life. The game uh, goes from like slow to fast to slow to craziness like it keeps you on your toes man it's a really good game and this game is also very similar to beyond two souls again if you guys have not seen those videos go back and watch them dude they're uh unique video games all right it's more like a movie type video game atmosphere is what it, it kind of seems like to me so this game heavy rain hints the rain that we can freaking hear right now and it is not raining here in michigan it is sunny and 90 degrees i'm assuming everybody else in the world is having a heat wave just like we are so y'all know what i'm talking about a little bit of rain wouldn't feel bad at all so like i say with every single demo version that we do play your prologue version whatever you want to call it, the same thing they are just a brief synopsis of the game you get a little bit of a hey here's what the game's all about and now when you buy the full version, the game's completely different for the most part. So we're going to start with a new story, folks. We have never played this actual, actual game. We played a prologue. Okay, so maybe, maybe, oh, shoot, we hit the wrong button. So maybe we can just uh, continue from the prologue. Is that what I'm understanding? That's what it looks like to me. So hopefully we can go back into the screen we were just in. Uh, okay, yeah, this is good. So here it is. This is uh, heavy rain, folks. It is Saturday. 11:22 a.m. and uh, looks like we are still sleeping. Must have had a late night, right? Late Friday night, you know what I'm saying? We are partying, man, checking out some ladies, trying to try to bring bring some women home, but we clearly did not bring anybody home but ourselves because we are letting literally laying in bed absolutely alone which is not a bad thing go out have fun come home be alone wake up don't have to worry about the awkwardness in the morning you can just be like peace and you can just sleep and sleep in all that fun stuff all right to interact hold left click and move the mouse all right buddy it is time for you to wake up wakey wakey eggs and bakey god i used to freaking hear that when my kids were little from their mom she used to always say that like <laughs> it's stuck in my head forever uh, try to do it slowly to see how you control the animation speed. Okay, well, he looks miserable. We have a wedding ring on, so clearly we're not out there uh, hopping, uh, bar hopping, looking for ladies. So maybe we just had a late Friday night. Who knows, man? Who knows? All right, so that's how we move. We're going to go ahead and check outside. It is a beautiful Saturday, folks. Beautiful Saturday. Let's go out here and see what's going on with the birds. I can hear the birds chirping the squirrels running around in the kangaroos. Do whatever kangaroos do. I really don't know what the hell they do. They hop around, they fight people. It is crazy. All right. Do you want me to look down? We're going to go ahead and look down over our backyard. Looks like we have a very nice backyard. Very secluded, which is good because we're literally out here in our boxers. Speaking of being in your boxers, I'm not kidding, dude. I drove by some dude's house the other day, and he was doing yard work in his boxers. Like, 100% his freaking boxers. I'm like, you got to be kidding me. Like... I know what's hot. What are we doing? We just gonna look up and down. Like I know what's hot, but go find a pair of shorts, man. Boxers are not very discreet. You know what I'm saying? It could uh, have one slight move, and your opening on the front of your boxer, something might get exposed, and the people of the world don't need to see your tater tots. So yeah, go ahead and put some shorts on, my friend. I don't know what that was about. It was absolutely bizarre, and it wasn't like it was a a wooded area. This was downtown in the city that i live in i'm like there is a million people around here bro anyways at any time you can listen to what your character thinks by pressing and holding that button okay so you want to go shower I better right. take a shower and get dressed before i go downstairs that sounds like a great idea so we're gonna have to hear you narrate yourself as well uh cool we got a letter here what is this probably not Gone gonna be shopping. good I'll pick the kids up from school at oh, lunchtime, it's just, it's just and then wife. I'll come We're home good. to get things ready for Jason's birthday party. Okay. Don't work too hard. I, I love will you. try not to, Grace. Thank you for getting the kids. Thank you for going shopping. Thank you for doing Grace things. I appreciate you, Grace. All right, let's go ahead and see what we got going on here, folks. This is going to be the room that we keep our bird in. Hello, bird. How are you doing? You just chilling? Hanging out? 
having a good time all right well that was interesting not sure why we had to go look at the bird but we just had to go say hi apparently so here is the shower room the shower room aka the bathroom holy freaking nice ass house all right well, let's go ahead and brush our teeth folks make sure you guys brush your teeth as well you know what i'm saying you don't want cavities you don't want all that dental nonsense because they can get really bad okay we're literally gonna brush this guy's teeth are you freaking kidding me like what are we doing all right, well, here we go. We're, we're brushing. We're brushing. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. He looks like he's hung over as hell. Like, he really does. I don't know what he had going on last night. If he if he was working or uh, maybe he maybe he did go out. I, I, I don't know. I think we're going to find out here in a little bit. Okay, we got to go up and down, guys. Make sure you go up and down. Get these teeth brushed just perfectly. Yeah, got to have healthy teeth. All right, buddy. You need to go back to bed, my friend, because you look like you just feel like hell like absolutely hell all right well we got that done folks let's go ahead and head on into the shower and uh scrub a dub and make sure we are good to go turn your head to see your actions are available okay well there's my head to do to do turn my head that way and how about down we can go down so we're learning how to operate our dude and so like i said man oh, oh. Rated, rated G here, friends. Okay, yeah, let's just keep that, that hidden behind the glass here. Anyways, oh my gosh. Somebody put a freaking blurp, blurp, a blurp box? A, what, what am I looking for when I blurp things out, I guess? Or they, whatever. Anyways, um, when we first played this game, we were not this character. Like I said, we were some rundown alcoholic private eye, and we were doing something somewhere in a in a building in the rain it was obviously it was raining because this game is called heavy rain okay so we're gonna dry our hair you know what i'm saying like this game is very <laughs> like very hands-on very hands-on this is like sims times 40 okay we're gonna put our, our dirty boxers back on that's all oh, yeah are those new ones yeah i'm pretty sure we had dark blue ones i'm not sure where they went to but they are they are gone so what do you want to do buddy uh awake take clothes what, what what clothes do we have to take let's go find okay so left control switches camera angles there we go it doesn't switch it really at all and we have to go find well that's the toilet we don't need to use that we gotta go find some clothes all right guys so this game is gonna get more interesting guys i promise you just bear with me like i say in a lot of games they're not gonna start out just action-packed ready to go like we're not just gonna you know start the game and holy hell we're in a, a firefight or we're in a gunfight whatever you know what i'm saying like it, it had we have to get to that stage it takes a hot second to get there we have to learn who this character is what he's all about what 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 are we doing with him you know what i'm saying why are we this character and not grace or any other character or do we play multiple characters in this game i don't know man only time will tell we will definitely cross that bridge when we need to but right now we need to figure out who this guy is, what he's all about, what we have to do today, because we have a very long day. We're, we're all showered up, ready to go. And uh, let's see what he's thinking here. So we have to go to work, folks. We have to go to work. Now, my question is, like I said before, what is work? What do we do for work? Are we an officer? Are we a, de a detective? Are we a handyman? Are we a model? Are we a firefighter? Maybe we're a bird keeper. I don't know. All right, awake. Well, Nothing like a refreshing shower. I almost feel awake. That's that's great, buddy. That's great. So what we're going to have you do, my friend, is we're going to have you walk downstairs, okay? Remember, you walk downstairs. It almost looks like he's blind because of the way I'm controlling him. <laughs> like, he's just looking. He's just looking. No, where are you going? This way. He's just, like, looking around. Do, 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 do. Don't know what I'm looking at. Don't know what I'm doing. Okay, the character starts change with the situation. Remember to check them uh regularly i just did all right we need to go attend to the garden because evidently the garden comes first folks work is always secondary in our life our garden is number one um is that our kid or is that just okay we're just that's not our kid all right we're gonna go ahead and close the door i thought that's where the garden was but evidently i was wrong which is the first time in my entire life I've ever ever been wrong just kidding I've been wrong once that's it. Only once. All right, so we're going to go ahead and pick up our kids' toys. Not sure where the kids are. I think they're at school is what she said, right? Well, let's go ahead and put his little uh, RV car away. Or we're just going to drive around like a crazy, crazy kid ourselves, man. You never grow too old to drive an RV, right? Absolutely not. Okay, so if I was the garden, which is what he wants to do, 
where would I go? That's the front yard, I believe, right? No, that looks like the backyard. So we could probably go ahead and go back here and then take care of the garden this way. Well, there is no door there. So that's going to be very much impossible. We can't go through a wall. What is my guy's name? All right. Well, I thought this was the, the garden. Wasn't this the door we just went out of? It is. We got to find the back door. Or we could just bypass a garden and say, screw it. Like, let's go hire somebody to take care of the garden. So clearly we just had a birthday party. Not sure if it was my birthday party. You guys clearly know it was not my birthday party. But why is everything still up? Why are the presents still there? Why did not or the uh, kid kids or kid, whoever's party was, why didn't they open up their presents, bro? That's the best part of a birthday party. When you're a kid and all your friends are showing up, they're bringing all these presents. You're like, this is badass. I'm going to get so much cool stuff. And then you just leave them sitting there like you don't even open them. What happened? Did something happen that drew the kids away, that, that took the kids away, took the wife away? You know, yeah, that note, that note is there, but has that note been there for a very long time? Or is that note brand new? I, I don't know. These are the answers we're going to get. We're going to get these uh, questions answered at some point in time. All right, is this our office here? Maybe we're a graphics designer or an architect or something like that. Yeah, it looks like we're some kind of designer. Okay, we're standing back up. We just had a long day of work. I, apparently, we don't want to work. Try it again, buddy. Try it again. I know you want to go to the garden. All right, the garden's going to be there, my friend. But you really need to start focusing on your work here, all right? Because this is what pays the bills. This is how you can go buy more seed for your garden, more fertilizer for your garden. All right, so we're doing an abstract type drawing or something. I'm not exactly sure what we're doing. I did take a class like this in high school before. It was crazy, dude. I don't know what the hell the class was about, but we were drawing on like massive pieces of paper like this, and I don't know why. It was a long time ago, but anyways, that not sure why I just told you that story, but hey, it kind of matched what we're doing here. So we are drawing a... Uh, not sure. Oh, we messed up. We didn't hit the yes button fast enough. But a simple Pierce, you have. I know that. I see that. All right, there we go. So we're going to keep our hands right here by the A, S, and D. Those seem to be the three keys that we're really focused on at this particular moment. So, yeah, we are some kind of designer. Yeah, we have to be like an architect or something. Or do we just do the drawings and somebody else builds? I Oh, no, that's not good. We messed up, Tommy boy. I'm so sorry. You're too fast. My bad, my bad. I didn't realize I had to go slow. There we go. That looks freaking perfect. Let's bring it on down. Bring it on down. There you go. It's looking like a house. Absolutely. We're going to hold that and use our little ruler here. We're going to press the Q button to see what happens. Oh, no. We got to just hold a Q button down or press a Q button. Not exactly sure which one we have to do I'm just gonna hold it down and it seems oh man okay well hang on I gotta concentrate here because this is getting a little bit uh, weird so we're doing the so it's the key it's the button that is highlighted so we're doing a left click on the mouse we're holding down the Q button we're doing a right click we're holding all three down at the same time there we go we drew a line I think I'm not exactly sure what we just did we're going to do it again, though. We're going to do it again. So I guess I didn't really say what this game is about. <laughs> like, um, yeah, for those of you who have never, never seen this game or even heard of this game, you're probably thinking, what the hell is he playing now? Like, this dude is a, is he a, is an architect simulator? No, that's, this is not what this game is, man. Um, let me get past this part, kind of give you guys a little insight of what this game is actually about. Yeah, we're doing some erasing here. We're erasing everything. Looking marvelous, buddy. Looking beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Is that it? Are we done? Is that our days? Is that our work day? Well, let's just stand up. So this game is basically we are... Uh, experience a gripping psychological thriller filled with uh, insurmountable twists and turns. So the hunt is on for a murderer known as the or Origami. Is it Origami? Yeah, Origami Killer. So basically, it's a psychological thriller. Um, trust me, it is going to get more intense than what it is here. All right. So let's go ahead and head over to the garden. So that that's my question. That's why I was like. 
you know, are our kids, are the kids still alive? Is the wife still alive? You know, we're in a house alone. This would not be the first time that we played a game and we started out like everything was perfectly fine and then come to realize everybody was dead. <laughs> so clearly not everything was perfectly fine because that just, uh, that, that came out of left field for that game. But uh, that's kind of the moral of the story. That's kind of what this game is going to be about, I'm, I'm assuming. All right, yes, let's go out to the garden. Open up your sliding glass door, buddy. Go ahead and head out there. You can garden until you're freaking done gardening. We got a sword down here. We have to have some kids still, still hanging out, man, unless we just haven't been out here. But the way he looks, dude, this, this just reminds me of something that went terribly wrong with this guy's family. It just doesn't add up. You know, again, I've never played this portion of it Oh, okay, I scratched all of that. Never mind. <laughs> or, or is it all in our head? Dad, <laughs> hey, Dad. take it easy. You're going to nope. knock me over. I guess they're still alive. Uh, so this is your big day, huh? Am I grown up now? Mm, I don't know. How old are you? Old, that's not exactly grown up, but you're getting there. What do you now, say, 12? can I drive your car? And I uh, think no. you're going to have to wait a little while for that. <laughs> okay, Ethan, so everybody is still... Can you please help me? Alive. There's Grace. Coming. Grace is bringing in all the groceries. I got it, Grace. Don't worry. Oh, oh, hang on. I'm just kidding. Ah, I psych. All right, we got to hold things down. If we don't hold it down, we cannot complete the process. Good job, man. Way to be a great husband, great father, a strong individual you are. I bet you those gross groceries uh, cost like so three hundred and forty-five dollars. Groceries are not cheap. What the hell is up with that refrigerator door? How's your day been? Managed to get any work done? Yeah, I did actually. Yeah, I did. I worked. I made some pretty good progress. I've we just actually work on a few more basically details, almost completed the entire drawing. The client. Ugh, I've got a billion things to do. It'll never be ready before Jason's pals arrive. Uh oh. Can you please help me? Yeah, what do you need? Uh, there should be plates in the living room cupboard. Okay, are you from America? You, do, you sound like you have a little bit of an accent. No okay. problem, leave it to me. Leave it to Beaver. Let's go and find, um, hey Grace, where is the living room cupboard? Where is all that at? I don't know where anything is in this house. I woke up and I'm a whole new person. Let's go and try to change the camera view there. They are outside fighting with the swords. Okay, hey, so. Hey, Ethan. What? I thought I asked you to take care of the plates. I'm, I forgot. They're in the living room cupboard, right? Yeah, but where the hell that? Where's yeah, that? Yeah, they haven't moved since last time I asked. Maybe they did move. Maybe there's a ghost in here, Grace. I don't need the attitude, all right? I don't need your tone. My guy just needs to learn how to walk, dude. He just looks like he's not doing well. You want these plates right here? Those are those are like not really plates, but there's bowls. Can you show me where they're at? <laughs> I am struggling. Um, I don't know. I, I really don't know where the hell is it over here. There we go. Bend down. You really, you really keep the plates that in there. That door oh. is always sticking. Well, Give open it. Give it a big tug. All right, big tug it is. I'm gonna break it. Oh yes, that's what I do. Let me grab some plates. Yeah, guys, this is not super That's exciting. I can neighbor. I can assure you it's be going careful, to get better. Okay? Don't worry. I wouldn't want to be responsible for a diplomatic incident with your mother. Oh, wow. We have a little we have a little toot with the hey, mother in law. Ethan, you said you were going to be careful. I'm sorry. I'll be more gentle. What did he do? Too fast. You should unfold the momentum slow momentum. Okay, well. I'll go slow. I'm not sure what I'm doing. Y'all acting like I'm breaking the plates. I'm barely, barely doing anything. Oh, God. Too fast. Ethan. Ethan. I know. <laughs> I told I know. you, bro. I'm I'm careful. Careful. I can call it, man. Like, oh, my gosh. Lady. Oh, no. We're going to make her mad again. If you want it done the right way or you want it done your way, get your ass out here and do it your way. <laughs> like, God damn. Uh, lady, I'm thirsty, or Grace, I am thirsty. Can I have something to drink, preferably whiskey? After dealing with you for five minutes, I already want to get drunk. Holy cow. Give me some of that, that bottle right there. Oh. Ooh. Ethan. What's up? I don't know if I've already told you this. I like it when you yell at me. It turns me on, Grace. But I find you very attractive. You're not so bad yourself, Mr. Mars. Mr. Mars? Oh, smoochy, smoochy. 
That's right. We're doing the old touching of the lips. Getting all down and dirty before the birthday party. Oh no, here comes Karen. She's gonna be like, get your hands right off her. There's children the around. Not the right time for it. Right time for what? Shame. I've really gotta focus on this party. Y'all seem high as we'll shit, man. Like y'all is in a later. different world, bro. That's what it looks like. Look at him. He's just like, oh man. I hope you got some chips, bro. When are Jason's friends coming? Never. Oh, uh, about 2 p.m. Never, ever, ever. I'll be able to keep the situation under control. Not like last year. Right. Uh, do you need more help that you can, can I do yell anything to help? For? No, thanks. Thank you. I should God. be able to manage. Good. Uh, present. Did you find the present for Jason? Yeah, I uh, picked it up from the store this morning. Good job. Oh, we're lucky. It was the last one in stock. Really? It's crazy. Jason looks happy. <laughs> yeah. It's hard This to is the most awkward conversation. Today. It seems ever. like only yesterday we were flirting in high school. It's like Getting you you two are just a brand new couple, man. Like it's just y'all trying to make small talk and you're married and it's just like, okay, well, I need some water. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. Give me some <laughs> orange juice in the fridge. <laughs> I love how he just narrates his life. Today, Grace, I am thirsty. I would like some orange juice. I'm going to go over to the refrigerator and grab some orange juice. Grace, I am bending down. Oops. Hang on. I am bending down, and I am grabbing the orange juice from the refrigerator. And now I'm going to shake it, Grace, as I am doing it like so. Make sure the pulp is good to go. I'm going to drink it from the carton because I am a dirty, dirty individual, and I am 12 years old. <coughs> and that was some hard-ass orange juice, bro. That was a screwdriver, a little bit of vodka, and orange juice. Don't worry about it, man. We got a kid's birthday party. You got to have a little bit of liquid courage to tolerate some kids, right? Because some kids can be crazy, man. Some kids can be I, 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 obnoxious, especially at a birthday party, man. It is go ape shit. So we had orange juice, and now we're drinking coffee. We're just... We're just drinking everything that we possibly can find. We are so incredibly thirsty. Uh, music. Wait, we don't want music. We don't want, we don't want the music now. Let's go watch some TV. Is that cool? All right. Well, I'm I'm out. How about uh, play with the kids? Let's go. Let's go outside and play with our children if we can. Oh, oh, he just got scared. Go ahead. I'm not sure I can even go out. I don't have the option to go out. So I'm pressing I think I'll go outside and play with go. the kids. Who are you talking to, buddy? Are you talking to the wall? All right. Well, clearly we cannot go that way. Which way are the kids? I need to know my house a little bit better because I don't know where anything is. I think we go out this way. No. So I'm pretty sure they are where the sliding glass door is. And if you guys have never played these types of games, it is not like an easy, easy controller type game. Controllers, the controlling of this game is not user friendly at all. And I'm not sure why these games are like that, but you just got to get used to it. It takes a little bit of time. But once you do get the hang of it, guys, it is pretty, uh, pretty simple for the most part. But it does take a hot second to get used to it. All right. Are we outside? Or are we just pretending to open doors? What are we doing? Yeah, go outside. Ethan, open the door. Ready? Go. There he goes. He finally made it outside. Let's go check on the garden. That's it. I'm free as a bird. Okay. Hey, five minutes, boys, okay? After that, we've got to eat because your friends are going to be here okay, soon. Okay, we promise, Mom. Oh, wait a minute. We're not going to eat with the friends. So they're going to come here and just food. watch no, us he eat. First. Easy, fellas. You can both have a turn. Um, What are we doing? All right, we're going to pick up this kid. All right, Jason, let's do the helicopter. He is the birthday boy. Oh, my gosh. What are we doing? Uh, we're spinning around and round and round we go. Uh, we're gonna be oh, gosh, guys, you're going to get seasick. My bad. All right, well, that was fun. <laughs> now go run a mile, Jason. <laughs> what the hell was that? All right, you ready it's there, Tommy? Now it's my turn. I don't even know what your name is. <laughs> I'm the worst dad in the world. All right, who wants okay, a piggyback Sean, ride? Get ready. Here we go. <laughs> oh, we're going to get a little bit of shaking because you know how we shake things. Just like the orange shoes. God, we're going to give this kid freaking whiplash, bro. Like, look at this shit. Like, what the hell is going on? 
I guess we can go a little bit slower. There we go. That's probably better. Oh, no. You're going to fall into the window and crack your head open. That's not going to be good. Would you get away from the window? My goodness, Ethan. Oh, gosh. Watch out for the <laughs> freaking plant. Or the plant. The plant. The plant. Um, now what? All right. Kick it off. I'm done. Is that a beehive down there? All the rocks. All right. Okay, we're just going to keep doing this forever. Yeah, just going to keep roll, running around the yard. Nothing to see here. Nothing to do. Birthday boy is probably out there playing by himself because we're just doing this. How do I get this? How do I stop this? Get down. Oh, let's go back over here. This way. And we are done. Come on, Dad. Show us how strong yeah, you are. Yeah, big muscles. Bro, he's skinny. Look at him. Be oh, he's got a little on. bit of muscle, but... All right, here we go. Her, don't pull a hernia. Whatever you do, don't pull a hernia muscle. You'll be in a hospital. You have to get surgery. That would, would not not be good. Okay, thank you. Thank you, guys. I'm so glad I can amuse you. Uh oh, now we're gonna play with the swords. Okay, so we're gonna fight. This fight time till you're the done death. for. You're gonna pay for all your crimes, evil one. Okay, <laughs> well, you ah, surrender, weakling. Bro, Save you don't even know who prayers. you're messing with. I'm gonna smack him right in the head. <laughs> Crack! I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna abuse the kids. Oh, That's you nothing. sliced my Jason belly button yeah. open. Scratch. Oh no! Attack! Attack! Oh, that's the wrong button. Oh, you got my ear. Yeah, that's great. Damn, dude. Yeah, that Jason. Was vicious. Uh, we are really, really striking out when it comes to the controls. Oh, we got a shin. No, not the shin. Anything but the shin. Continue. Bro, you gotta let your son win. What are you doing? Oh, yeah, the right shoulder. Right. Let's go. <laughs> well, we won. Food's ready, kids. You coming, coming in? No. Do we have a choice? I didn't think we had a choice. Okay. I'm going to walk in and see what's going on with this food. So yeah, this is Sean? a very interesting, is ready. Um, I'll very go get interesting first episode, guys. I did not expect it to be like this at all. Do I? Where, where am I going? Do I get to sit down? Or my ban. What the hell are you doing? Figure it, <laughs> figure it out. Uh, is my chair right here next to you? Skunk Sean. <laughs> is that my other kid? Why isn't Sean at the table? Yeah, he should where is be he? around here somewhere. Hello, Grace. Well, I guess she's just not gonna talk to me. All right, so we have Sean, we have Jason, we have Ethan, we have Grace. Those are those are. Our names. All right, let's go find. Let's go find Sean. I'm not sure what he's doing or where he's at or why he's not at the dinner table. This is not uh... Sean. This is not good. Sean. Hello. All right. What is that? It's like a giant dragonfly. All right, let's go inside the house. Maybe Sean's inside his, inside the house. I don't know. Maybe he's in the bedroom. Sean, what I'm, are you doing? I don't know where We're he is. Waiting for you. I'm trying to find him. Is he upstairs? I'm sure glad nobody talks to me. All right, let's go see if we can make it upstairs, change the camera view a little bit. And that's the one thing about this game, guys. You don't get to pick really what camera view you, you use. You get a couple couple views and that's what they give you and that's it so it makes it hard sometimes to actually actually control your player all right we're gonna go upstairs see if sean's up here something happened he was having a great time all of a sudden we went in, went inside for dinner he's just like tripping for some reason Ethan, can you grab sean I, bitch i'm trying to what do you think i'm doing <laughs> god dude sean what's up what's up kid what's up it's merlin oh no he's dead Oh shit. He's dead and it's all my fault. Why is it your no, fault? No, it's not, Sean. Of course it's not your fault. What'd you do, Sean? Did you kill I the bird? I'd do anything if you could come back to life. 
Uh-oh. You know, Sean, there's some things which just have to happen. Even if you don't want them to. It's not fair, Dad. I killed the moment. It's not taking fair. A screenshot. How was it? The bird was just fine. How is it dead? I know. Like, the bird was literally just just fine. We looked at it. And it's just like, burp, deader than a door now? Like, did you, tr did you strangle it? Like, what do you mean? Why is it your fault? What did you do to the bird, Sean? Hmm. Okay. So, folks, that is going to do it for episode one. This was definitely, definitely not what I expected. Uh, the very first, uh, not the very first, but the prologue version that we did was nothing like this, which this is fine, guys. This is going to open the door for lots of other things. So, clearly, there's going to be something with with death, right? The bird's dead. Why is the bird dead? The kid's like, hey, I'd give anything to bring that bird back. Are we going to have some super duper crazy powers come up? We can like bring stuff back from the dead. I don't know, man. So I'm curious to see what happens here in episode two, which we'll play here in the next few days. Uh, but yeah, give it, give this game a break. All right. It, it's, it's going to get a lot better. I promise you. And there's, there's folks out here that are probably watching this. that have played this game. You guys gave me awesome reviews when we first played this game. So clearly you guys know what you're talking about. And that's why I've actually bought the game is based on a couple of reviews or comments that I saw when we did the actual uh, prologue version. So with that being said, folks, hope you guys have a great rest of your Wednesday, man. Have a great day tomorrow at work or at school. Well, probably school's over, but whatever you're doing, man, just have a, have a great Thursday and I will see you next time.